Hey, what's good, YouTube? You know, I'm back with another pickup, and as you can tell, it is the Jordan 4. You know, today is February 18th, 2012, and it was the release date of the Air Jordan 4 Retro White Cement, or um, Tech Gray, whatever you want to call it. But these are the white cements. I think it actually does say white cement on the box. It should say white cement. Yep. White, black, cement, gray. Retail price 160 Picked these up for retail price. It came out today. It was actually pretty crazy. I didn't think it was going to be that crazy for these, but it was pretty crazy. Um, the store I got mine from only had eight pairs, and it was a real weird size run, but they only had eight pairs. They had a seven and a half, eight, eight and a half, nine, and then a 12 and a 13. The only, so it was really crazy. That size run was weird, but, you know, of course, I got the only 12. And this is the box, um, as you can see. So it's kind of like the three box. Only thing that's different is this has flight on it. The three does not. And then, of course, the this cement pattern is different than the cement pattern on the um, three box. And then, of course, you got the hole right here. And this is the new Jordan label, I guess. I guess they're going to start putting that in all the boxes. I don't know. Then the air, you know, the box. And it says air right here and then the bottom. So, yeah, that's it. That's This is the box. But let's get into the shoe. Uh, let's get into the shoes. So the shoes, it slides up. There you go. Flight and then the inside is that red, bright red box. But yeah, let's get into it. It's the shoe. And these shoes, in pictures, they, they were like, okay. They're starting to look nice, but in person, these shoes are just really nice for real, for real. I'm not even going to lie. But as you can see, yeah, these are the shoes. The quality needs is not even that bad at all. It's pretty it's pretty decent. I haven't tried them on a still factory lace. I wanted to do the review before I like tried them on or nothing. See so I can see what they look like. Here they are. Let's put that to the side. Let's put this one to the side. Um but you can see you got this black paper in there. It's kinda I don't know what type of print like what type of material this is, but it's nice. It's not it's not quite like the trash bag type material, but it's nice and as you can see it has like little black indents on it. It's really nice. And you can see that's the box. Let's, let's put the box to the side. Here it is, the 2012 White Cement 4. My first pair of 4s, so bear with me. <laughs> I don't know much about these 4s because, you know, they came out before I was even born. So, so you know, but see, these have the hang tag on them. Some of them don't have hang tags, as I saw today. Some, some pairs didn't. But I actually looked up, and this pair has the hang tag. And if you do have the hang tag, it should be on the right shoe. This is the right shoe. But, yeah, let's put that back. But, anyway, the whole upper of the shoe is that white, smooth leather. As you can see, the toe box is that white, smooth leather. And all that is the white, smooth leather. The midsole is kind of like that. I'm, I'm about to say it wrong. That poly... Poly something well I don't know what it's called but that you know that that hard type midsole the potty yep dream something like that I said it wrong <laughs> you laugh at me whatever I don't know what it's called but you know it's that midsole which is the cement gray right here and this same material is right here on the upper right here with that cement gray pattern with also that cement gray pattern in the back the only thing that separates these different from the um the OGs is that it said Nike Air with the check instead of the Jumpman, as you can see. But like I said, you got the white, the white smooth leather. Then right here to the midsole, you got that that cement gray pattern, followed by the black, very hard black for very good support when he wore these. Um, then of course you got the Air unit. The threes and the fours have the Air unit, you know, right there. You can see the air bubble, and you have the white midsole right here. And then come down to the bottom, you got your gray. Your white, red jump man, your black, your red, and your gray. And then you can see the stars in the front. They really brought the stars out on these, as you can tell. Um, the shoe is a very nice shoe, though, I'm not even going to lie. Um, you can see you got the black right here, the eye stays up, up top. The eye stays are really white, but it has the black over top. And then right here, kind of like on the five, is that it's not mesh, but it's like that kind of net material. That you can catch on the side here and then on the front right here, that kind of net material right there, as you can see. And then, of course, you got your white laces 
Followed by the flight tab right here with the red jump man. It's right there. It says flight and the jump man, just like on the box. Um, and then the fours have the upside down Air Jordan. Right there, it says Air Jordan upside down. And the fives have Air Jordan, but I don't think it's upside down. I forgot. I gotta look at my fives, but yeah. And then in the inside, let's see, you see it says 12. You got the jump man in there. And of course, you got the hang tags. Some of them didn't come with them. Just like some people's tens didn't come with hang tags, mine's did. Um, people that didn't know, if you didn't get a hang tag with your tens, you're supposed to call Nike, give them your address and stuff to ship you out one. So I don't know, I don't know if they're going to do the same thing with these. Um, but if they do, I'm probably going to call because it doesn't hurt to have an extra hang tag. Because, you know, there's other fours coming out this year, and I don't think they're having hang tags. So I might, you know, cop another one and add it with, like, my, with the breads that are supposed to be coming out Black Friday 2012 or the fire reds that come out in um, June. I might have to do that. Um, and then you're inside. You got the shoe tree, and it has actually tissue paper under the shoe tree, actually. I didn't even notice that. But, yeah, that's it. But it's really nice. The, the cement print on this is really, really nice, actually. I really like these. I kind of actually like these better than my black cement threes. And or I really do. I don't know why. I like the cement. The cement print is better on this than the threes, in my opinion. Real dope, real dope. But here it is. Here's the other shoe. <laughs> Some people might say, boy, your foot long as shit. I'm aware of that. My foot is long. 12. You see, that's the bottom of them. But they're, they're just a really nice, really nice shoe. There's the hang tag. Really high quality. Yeah, I think it's pretty decent. The quality is really nice compared to all the other stuff I've seen in the past years. Since I've been getting their shoes. These are really nice quality for 160. I'm not even going to lie. I know a lot of people didn't get them. They were sick. I mean, it's, it was just crazy how everything went down. But as you can see, here it is right here. Both shoes are the same. Upside Air Jordan and the right shoe, just like the left shoe. Everything is the same. I just explained. You know, the white, smooth leather upper, the net type material here, the white shoe strings, the cement gray midsole with the black, the air bubble, and, of course, in the that on the back. So let's see. Let's put this. Uh, so yeah, it is the Air Jordan Four Retro White Cement 2012. You can see that's it. So you know, comment, rate, subscribe. Hit me up with any questions about these. If these were um an easy cop for you, an instant cop, you didn't like them, why? You know, just let me know. I'm gonna be back. So you know, just keep. Keep watching my videos. I appreciate all the support and the subscribers and stuff. And I um, appreciate y'all a lot. So um, tune in. Um, I don't know what my next pickup is going to be. Maybe the LeBrons because um, they come on a Friday. It means I'm going to have to miss school for those. And I don't know. It might be the LeBrons. But if not the LeBrons, my next my ex, my next actual Jordan pickup is going to be the playoff 12. Those are the next joints <laughs> I actually want are the playoff 12. So, um, so yeah, that's my next Jordan pickup of the 12s. But my next LeBrons are either going to be those, um, the, um, all-star, all-star ones or the, um, mango ones. But those both come out on Friday, so I don't know. And I kind of want them Galaxy phone pauses, but it's not worth dying over. Like, it's not that serious. Them just going to be crazy. Like, it's a real nice shoe, but all the hype on the shoe is ridiculous. So I might not even mess with those. But, um, yeah, like I said, thank y'all for watching. Comment, rate, subscribe, and I'm, I'm going to catch y'all next time on my next pickup.